Let's mess about with this globe today. I bought this quite some time back when going to the thrift store was still a thing. And it has been looking at me while I was waiting for some inspiration. But today is the day. And to start with, I will take it apart because as you can see, there is a bit of wiggle room, a bit too much. So by taking it off the rod and adding some gears, I think a couple extra layers will help this to be more snug and it will look better as well. Now for the transformation of this little globe I will use very simple materials, texture paste, a lot of gears and odds and ends, doodads. Everything I do to alter this will be very easy to follow. So like always any mediums I will be using or any explanations you may need will be in the captions and I will talk to you towards the end. Enjoy!
So here is another one of my assemblage tile altered objects. Here you can see the pretty beads and the zipper, the foot down here. I always like to add something unpainted, therefore the gear shaft. Here is the big arrow and all the little doodads that make up the decoration here on the bottom. Now on the top you can tell that the continents are still very clearly visible. Of course they are not as crisp as when they were just printed on paper, but that's not what I was after. For very last thing, I want to add a simple dangle. I have this charm of a compass, which I think fits nicely to the globe idea, and a piece of chain and the closure from an old necklace. I will just attach it up here uh, at the gear and then hang it on that little hook I added earlier. Of course, the chain and the dangle will go uh, all over the place when I turn the globe, but it will give it a little bit extra movement and interest. Now, I really like to work on these type of pieces. I love the texture and the color, and this will be a nice addition to my collection. I hope you enjoyed watching me put this together. I know uh, that my camera view was not the best all the way through, but I think you got the idea. I want to thank you so much for coming, and I hope I get to see you soon again. I wish you a good weekend, stay well and healthy, stay creative, and bye-bye for now.